Hey YouTubers and YouTube Rats, this is Connor I'm CEO here. Welcome back to another episode of The Flash and it's the 21st episode and it's called Harry and the Hendersons. Now it's not exactly Bigfoot and the Hendersons, it's exactly Earth 2 Harrison Wells and other uh, multi-Earth Harrisons. Anyway, let's just watch it. What is she doing at 5.15 in the morning? Dude, put some pants on. Why are you so awake? What is all this? This is every file, every report, every footnote that I could find on DeVoe. I couldn't stop thinking about DeVoe and his machine. And now that he has all of the satellites, I mean, he could turn on the machine at any point. And has somebody gone cuckoo? The satellite tech that DeVoe... You lock too? I think DeVoe plans to position so each... So, has any of them had any sleep? ...specifically basically emit a series of dark matter bursts. ...that will reboot the prefrontal cortex of every man, woman, child on this earth. I think we shoot him down. Oh. There is one small problem. DeVoe has Kilgore's powers. DeVoe's not acting. Why is he not acting? But it doesn't matter. But it does matter. Oh, and if I had my intelligence, I could figure that out. Harry, no, not, not dumb me. The other me's. The Council of Wells. The Council. There's him again. Question. How does your high percentage Thinking character account for the resonant of coupling of the dark matter transfer. Oh, no, that's not fair. In the box, put the box in the pocket, talking to Harry, simple question. How does it account for the. Ah! He doesn't know. That's not funny. He doesn't know. In the box, put the box in the pocket, press the box in the pocket. This you know where you can box stick box that box? Accept the challenge of others. With superior intellects, it's called the council. I'm not. You're going to betray one of your own because he doesn't meet some arbitrary intellectual standard. Oh, so you do understand? I feel the same. I don't like you anymore. He's right. Do you have any ibuprofen? Thanks. What's wrong with your head? Uh, Acupuncture. Ever since oh. I found out, I still have a cryogenic anomaly in my DNA. You really do miss it, don't you? Yeah, my killer frost was a part of me, and just as I was starting to accept her, she was taken away. And she did say, don't let Katie die. I try to attack it from a different direction. If that helps. I mean, thanks. Aminette. Uh -huh. I know she's not the ideal choice, but... And she kidnapped you. She tried to sell me into medical slavery. And she ruined my bachelorette party. You can't partner up with Aminette. Yeah. She's Sorry, it's a criminal. So is Killer Frost. What makes you say she'd be willing to help us? I I've seen a different side of her. She You've already called her. Before, and You've already called her. It. You've already called her. I give to you the emotionally astute Council of Heresies. There you are. Other stiffs. Well, they got tired of my connections. Making me tardy to their party, so... <laughs> they gave me the boot. All of us been kicked out. All of you have been kicking got me a kill this guy. <laughs> what is that? Allow myself to improve myself. <laughs> are, are you Fonzie? 24. Hello. So, I am Harrison H.P. Wells, the Earth Van Sank. So, to see us all bonded by our faces and our hearts. You scarf, I like that scarf. I want to get myself one of them classy scarves like this guy. I once had this experience with a hard apple pie. Okay, you know what? Okay, do not finish that sentence. Because I've seen that movie. We let somebody else share. I'm Harry. I don't want Harry. Bonjour, Harry. He knows me. So, uh, our intelligence is, and so I'm asking for your help to get my intelligence back so I can kick some. <clears throat> so, no, man, of course, Harry. Of course, we will help you. We will help you. Open your heart. We will open your mind. Illegal gambling. With headers and mob bosses. CPD, this is an illegal operation. Everybody out of the room. Just like clockwork. Leave it to your crafty little brain to figure out my dark secret. <laughs> with the accent, it's part of my disguise. I had to blend in. Now I'm just your average American boy making an honest living. Flash. Uh. Oh. What the hell have you done to your hair? That DeVoe is about to launch a bunch of 
satellites into space that are going to reset all of our brains. That thing. Why do you still have it on? It's doing a terrible job. What? Stoic jawline. Patrician profile. Insta, <laughs> I tried to procure from the warden. Making R.I.P. She's seen your face. Come on. All right, all right, all right. He would be so easy to cosplay the dude in the night going. Don't close our eyes and take a moment to imagine that we are all sociopaths. Come on, I'm joining in. Now, what do you see? What do you smell? I feel you're mocking me. Oh, and I'm How is that mocking? I do. I do. has slicer technology that she used to split Killer Frost last year. I was hoping to use it again to get Killer Frost to come out. Well, that splicer tech isn't your only hope. Yes, it is, Joe. I have tried everything that I can think of to get Killer Frost to appear, and that was my last shot. So now she's gone for good. You can trick the vote by touching you again. That came out wrong. For that, I apologize. You just but brought out your feelings. You apologized. No, no, it's, it's just, that was, that was very real. Maybe it is time I consider someone else's feelings. <laughs> well, I feel a little devout. Put myself in his shoes. Exactly. Yeah. Is that what you were going to say? No, I was going to say devout. Right? Did not cure you. What? What? So needy. And so I put that piece of tech on your head and nothing. Placebo effect. But just because the spicer didn't technically work doesn't mean that the results were not the same. It's a placebo. You see, it's been inside you the entire time. What are you talking about? I know exactly where Novok is. He, she has a Quilla de Vel face, doesn't she? 30 times stronger than steel. They're loaded with enough potential energy to flatten the city. Oh dear. Steals off. Those shards belong to Aminette. She should have told me where she hid them. Decrepit. That's a big word for such a small man. Ew. What the hell are you? Oh crap! Oh, Barry, come on, your immune system can check that off. Just hang in there. Barry, what's going on? Your vitals are going through the roof. Oh, come on. There we go. Hello, man in the iron mask. Oh, oh, crap. That'll cause him to suffocate. Wrong eye. Dark matter and 
And I know they'll feel the same way when they read your article. Let's tell the team. I don't think this is a good idea. They're going to cause a panic. What did I do to deserve that? That's for giving me the advice I needed, even when I didn't want to hear it. I was convinced that that Spicer technology was the key to getting Keller for us back, but I was wrong. Learned that from Emmy Night. Mm -hmm. I thought the answer was in science, but it was never going to be there. So what now? You're finding Keller Frost. It's not out there. It's in here. Up oh, late again. What's happening? Mary, what? it's the city. What? I posted my article and they're responding. What? Like, yeah, seriously? Like, more than that. They want to help. Look. I'm not buying that. This means the vote can't hide from us anymore. Okay, I'm not buying that. Okay, uh, for one, his wife, well, probably ex-wife, no, he stole the chair and took off. So that means he can't do the enlightenment without that chair, because it's obvious with that chair he needs to do the enlightenment. And now he's walking all over the place, and uh, by the sounds of things, he's lost, he's confused, he's basically Harry, except he's not losing his intelligence. And I thought that was really, really lousy, what um, that Dr. Phil wannabe Harry was, like, slagging, insulting Harry off. It's like, oh, you're turning into an imbecile. Put this is go put it in the box and then squish into my pocket. Talk about rude. But it was good that he had a little bit of um, NA, you know, uh, lost intelligence and anomalous. Got into a group of other Harrisons. One that I, then the one that was familiar that he was wearing the red silk, uh, robe that looked like he was coming out of a Hugh Hefner convention and there's a guy who sounds like he's a Bronx type of Harrison Wells and obviously another Harrison who is French which I think he said he's from Earth 23 or Earth 24 and um, and, it wa and it was surprisingly weird seeing Cisco recovering that quick after him and uh, Gypsy broke up which was he's probably putting a game face on to try and get through the day and uh, Iris is still doing her article stuff and she was sending the word about uh, what's going to be happening to the world and people have to be at the ready but pretty much uh, obviously if they would have read this article they would have the city would have been in panic and you would have saw Iris looking out the window going I uh, should see what my article did out there everybody's trying to pack their things and leave how are they going to leave everywhere around the world is going to be losing their intelligence including smart young kids now I would love to see this in the Big Bang Theory, where you see Sheldon going, Have you seen what Dr. Defoe is planning to do? I'm going to lose my intelligence, Leonard! <laughs> oh god, I nearly sound like, uh, oh, I'm not doing that again. Uh, anyway, and also, um, the, oh, damn, I forgot her name already. Uh, the girl who was able to control the metal, which of course she was in a space, uh, she was in a airplane of the cause that the particle accelerator exploded, which also matches her material in the the metal, has uh, been in hiding ever since uh, Wolf and DeVoe went doll crazy at the the Blackgate uh, prison. Is that a Blackgate? Ah, uh, well, well, anyway. Uh, oh no, Iron Heights, where they had the uh, metahuman dampening cells in the bottom floor. And uh, I can't believe Barry didn't see that coming. He's like, Barry, she knows who you are. She saw you in your cell. He's like, this is the super speed meta that I was about to have for the brightest bit of that. But I did not know that it was the flash. I would have made a million, you know, whatever. And uh, I can't believe this entire time she thought that the splicer caused Caitlin to split in half and able to go on and off as Killer Frost. But it was all inside her already she was able to go all Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde with Killer Frost and Caitlin and she really does miss her and I'm pretty sure that uh, Killer Frost misses her too because remember that episode where she says please don't let Katie die she wants to protect her even though she's not going to show up but she knows deep down that she cares for her and um, I'm feeling really sorry for Harry because he's this close for Lisa's intelligence but hopefully there's a way to bring it back and hopefully to get Killer Frost back and uh, at least uh, she gave a piece of her metal to help her to create this metapar missile to take down the satellite that she said hopefully it works. 
And hopefully uh, Nick's ex-stinker is going to be hiding that chair because with that chair, he needs to build the enlightenment. And obviously with all the powers that he has, he's going to make himself this huge intellect mega meta human. You know, kind of like Metamorpho, except, uh, forgive me for saying Metamorpho, not but ugly. But uh, obviously, we guess we have to wait for the next uh, two episodes, I think. Two more episodes to finish off with The Flash. And then some. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this reaction video and I hope you enjoyed the episode. And uh, please stay tuned for other episodes I have to react to. And uh, please send comments on uh, either this video or my future videos sh if should I really react to Cobra Kai because I've been hearing great reviews, I've been hearing great things about it and I really want to react to it or well I really want to watch it but I want to hear your opinions of uh, should I react to the Karate Kid miniseries Cobra Kai. So anyway to the YouTubers and YouTube Reds, I'm Connor Arm CEO, thank you and overnight.